Okay guys, time for another unboxing video. And this, I just got another Disney store packet, a new box that arrived in the post and something that I got on shopdisney.com or as you'd like to call it, the Disney store. And this unboxing video is all to do with Fantasia, which was Walt Disney's third animated classic. It's been more than 80 years since Walt Disney came up with an idea for a concert movie to be like anything that the world had ever seen, breaking new ground in animation, sound, and technology. And with the suggestion of Philadelphia Orchestra conductor Leopold Stokowski, it was called Fantasia. It would, and it was one of the crowning achievements of Walt's career. Um, and, and the concept for Fantasia was that it would be a continually evolving showpiece with the wonders of animation but the idea fell by the wayside until 60 years later with the release of Fantasia 2000 on his 60th birthday. So this year, we're celebrating Fantasia's 80th birthday and the 20th anniversary of Fantasia 2000. And now, let's hope we get some Fantasia pieces of merchandise in this Disney store box. Let's have a look. And yet, this, the same... Christmas uh, line towards the night before Christmas, and all through the house, not a creature was stirring, not even a mouse. And it happened on the same, in the same box where I unboxed the plush toy of Mickey Mouse from the Christmas ad this year. Anyways, let's open the rest. And I know the rest when I open this thing. Uh, you get to color in all of Mickey Mouse's and the, and all of his friends, uh, like a coloring box sort of thing. Same thing that I did two weeks ago. Anyways, moving on. I was right. It is, it is Fantasia merch. Wow, would you look at this. It's like I'm holding a book. I'm just messing with you. This isn't actually a book. This is actually a book with a set of two pens and a set of postcards. But it looks like you're holding an actual book, but this book isn't actually a book. It's like a case of for your postcards and your pens. And on the front cover, you see Mickey Mouse on a, on the, on the book trying to reverse the spell to make the broomstick stop carrying the water for him to fill a cauldron. And, and it's all in the sequence called The Sorcerer's Apprentice, and it's one of my favorite sequences in the original Fantasia, as well as the Pastoral Symphony from Ludwig van Beethoven. And on this side here, you got the Fantasia logo and Mickey Mouse and his magician's hat. Um, yeah, in the Sorcerer's Apprentice, um, he, he wants to use some magic on broomsticks for carrying the water, but he kind of messes everything up. Um, this was shown twice in Fantasia, and then 60 years later, it was repriced in Fantasia 2000. Anyways, let's open this book up. And as you can see, this looks like a bookmark. Voila! A set of Fantasia postcards and two pens. Oh. Oh. This is wonderful. And the first postcard is Mickey Mouse using his magic at the stars whilst he was dreaming and exhausted and wanted to take a rest. But uh, he's too focused on dreaming. Oh my gosh. Oh my god, look at the color on this pen. There's Mickey Mouse on here. And all around the pen, you see Mickey Mouse um, setting up, um, putting, up his, putting on the magician's hat and using his magic. And on the top here, he brings the stars down to the river, uh, to the lake, or the ocean, whichever one's which, and to make the water move like tidal waves crashing into the rocks. And now, how about the second pen? And the second pen, it's stuck, it's stuck, I messed it up. And second pen, we have the broomsticks, the magical broomsticks in which Mickey brought to life. And they're carrying, it's carrying two buckets of water to fill a cauldron. And as you can see, uh, Mickey Mouse is telling, is using the broomstick, is telling the broomstick what to do. 
uh, to go to the water fountain to fill the cauldron um, and then do the same thing over and over again and until he was too distracted he was too distracted until he went into a dream we'll go over the postcards uh, later on uh, the postcards they look they look wonderful by the way um, although this is the first one this you see and as soon as you open it you see a Fantasia poster with the different sequences from the original classic from Walt Disney in 1940. The Sultra's Apprentice, to the Nutcracker Suite, and to the Hours of the Day sequence, I think, and the Pastoral Symphony from Ludwig van Beethoven, just to name a few of the sequences that you'll see in the original classic. I'll put you aside for now. Wow. And this is another item I bought on the Disney store, and it's a pad folio. And on the cover, on the front cover, you see Mickey Mouse again, and you see a quote from Walt Disney saying, Adults are only kids grown up anyway. Nice speech there, Disney. And I, I, and I got it on the Disney store for about 26 quid, um, 26 pounds in the US, in the UK. I don't know how much it was in the US. So let's open this portfolio. Would you look at this? We got more quotes from Walt Disney himself, like this one. Uh, it's kind of fun to do the impossible. And this one, happiness is a state of mind. I could say happiness is a state of mind and as Disneyland is my happy place. And finally, another quote over here, the love I love the nostalgic myself. I hope we never lose some of the things of the past. And what you see here are pieces of stationery. And we got ourselves another pen with Walt Disney's signature. And happiness is a state of mind quote on the other side. This looks wonderful. This is a ballpoint pen. I don't even know how you open this thing. But never mind. Let's leave the pen aside. Oh, this even has a zipper. Uh, like a wallet. It's empty, by the way. It's completely empty. Let's open up here. And I think we have a notebook in here somewhere. I was right. It looks like a notebook. Again, we have the same Fantasia poster. And I think it's the same quote from when we opened the book. It's kind of fun to do the impossible. And I think it is kind of fun to do the impossible. Let's open this notebook and it's lined it's lined paper and as soon as you open to a page where you want to write your entries you see mickey mouse bringing the boomstick to life to carry the water for him as seen in the sorcerer's apprentice sequence oh i think i spotted something i think this is storyboards these are storyboards they're sketches um for the sorcerer's apprentice that's something i did not see wow, it looks wonderful and we see the layout for the head, same as ever. The place eyes on each side of middle line. Uh, I think this is a how-to. I think this is a how-to draw Mickey Mouse from the Sorcerer's Apprentice. And we have this one of the same quotes from when we opened this portfolio. I love the nostalgic myself. I hope we never lose some of the things of the past. What else do we have here? Oh, we have more Sorcerer's Apprentices. Uh, we have some snippets, some um, images from each of the cell animated sequence. Um, Mickey putting on the hat, uh, sh Mickey showing the broomstick to fill the buckets with water, um, Mickey going into a dream, and there's Mickey bringing the stars down to him using the magic, um, and Mickey kind of messing everything up, and there's a little dent on the top of the magician's hat. Oh! We have another quote. This special secret, it seems to me, can be summarized in four C's. There are curiosity, confidence, courage, and constancy. And, and the greatest of these is confidence. And this is alliteration. Um, three or four words with the same letter, beginning with the same letter. When you believe a thing, believe it all over. Implicity, Im impl implicitly, and unquestioningly unquestioningly. Um, I feel like I'm messing that word up. What's next? 
a classic Fantasia poster, the ultimate in sound, in sight and sound. Another quote. We keep moving forward, opening up new doors and doing new things because we're curious and curiosity keeps leading us down new paths. I think this is one of the quotes that I saw at the end of Meet the Robinsons, released in 2007, I think. Um, and, and it ended with keep moving forward. That's what Walt Disney said. Is there anything else? I think that's it. That's it from this notebook with the postal in the front. Oh, let's should look at that. And finally, once you spend up to 50 quid buying items on the Disney store, you get yourself a free um, Disney key, oblique ceremony key. Not that, not very big key, but a small sized key. And this is Fantasia. And remember in my last Disney unboxing video, I got a Mickey Mouse key. But this one is Fantasia with stars and the crescent moon on the D sign. Mickey Mouse um, showing the boobsticks where to go, like follow the leader. We have the Fantasia logo at the end of the key. And we have the Disney castle again. How about that? And the same thing on the reverse side. How about that? This, this is wonderful. So why don't we go and have a look at the postcards from this here postcard book, shall we? I know just a place to have a look. Okay, let's open this book again, not actually a book, and go over the postcards. Carefully. Uh, there's nothing underneath. It's probably another Mickey Mouse cell. And yeah, this is a bookmark. Careful now. First card, as I mentioned, it was from the Sorcerer's Apprentice. And the gold on the logo for Fantasia, it's it's beautiful. Very beautiful. And on the back here of each card, you see the 80 years sign, the Fantasia logo, and Mickey Mouse um, showing the broomstick where to go. And now we have Mickey Mouse um, bringing the broomstick to life. And this is another one. This is from the Pastoral Symphony sequence uh, with one of the centaurettes, which are half half woman, half horse. Same thing goes for centaurs, half man, half horse. And another one from the Sorcerer's Apprentice when the magician is making a butterfly out of his magic at the beginning of the sequence. And there's Mickey Mouse on the book. Um, messing everything up and trying to stop the spell from the broomsticks um, carrying so much water and flooding the whole place. And then we have the Goddess of the Rainbow from the Pastoral Symphony. And then now we've got some fairies from the Nutcracker Suite. And I think this is another one from the Nutcracker Suite. These are dandelion fairies, I think. Um, I can tell by the dandelions representing the, the, the white dresses when they dance around in circles. Another Nutcracker postcard, um, a, a swimming fish, a swimming fish. And, and there's some bubbles surrounding each fish. And we have a classic Fantasia poster with the ultimate in sight and sound. Another pastoral postcard um, with one of the Pegasuses, which are, which is a flying horse from probably from Greek mythology. Uh, underneath blossoms, I don't know what type of flower it is. And we have the we have the Mickey Mouse drawings, um, a how to uh, a how to draw Mickey Mouse type of poster uh, postcard. And we have the Pegasus children um, playing around in the water, swimming around, and the black one flying very slowly and carefully into the water. 
and we have one of the dancing flowers dancing around to the in the Nutcracker Suite. We have a beautiful sight of the waterfalls and in the Greek mythology mountain countryside, I think, in the Pastoral Symphony, right before we go into the second act of the Pastoral Symphony. And we've got Mickey again. I think these are the yeah. I think these are the same postcards. Yeah, I think they are the same postcards. I think they've given us the postcards um twice. Oh, boy, there's a lot of postcards that I got in this packet. Wow. I think that that's all of the postcards I have that are included in this postcard and pen set. Wow, it's, I think, 20. I think these are 20 postcards in this pack. Uh, you know what, I'll just leave this bit, put it in the bin. It doesn't matter if I mess things up with this postcard set. Let's put it back in its rightful place in the book. This is beautiful. What a wonderful way to celebrate um, the 80th anniversary of Disney's third animated classic, Fantasia. And you can watch both Fantasia movies, Fantasia and Fantasia 2000 on Disney+. Plus. And start your subscription at disneyplus.com. It's time to close the book and actually close the whole box. Actually, I have another Disney Store pack unboxing video coming. I won't tell you what it is yet, but I gotta say, happy anniversary, Fantasia. And here's to another 10 years. If you haven't seen Fantasia, then this is something you should watch for the whole family, if you're a fan of classical music as well. For my grandmother, who likes classical music, and Fantasia is classical music. Thanks for watching the unboxing video. Be sure to subscribe and hit the notifications, and I'll see you on the next video.